Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the Gamer Peons. Today we're playing some Minecraft, but well, we're not playing Minecraft exactly. This is uh, me building a lighthouse of some kind, but it's, I'm not really there for the lighthouse. I just thought it would be a good introductory video of some sort. So I thought I'll build a lighthouse just because I felt like building a lighthouse. Not the first lighthouse I've built. Built several of them. Don't know why. <laughs> I've built loads of random stuff, but it's more to show if I've, you know, got any... Neat building skills, that is. So here, here he goes, a times four speed video. So originally this took me about 30 minutes. And it's not too long for an average building. Then again, I was going like, I was just like testing things, seeing what looked good, seeing what didn't look good, stuff like that. You can see I'm using several, several tools, World Edit and Voxel. I, I don't really use them that much here, just, you know, for things I don't need to waste my time with. But... The thing, I, some of you are probably like, oh, he uses Voxel, he's not true to the building, and I, I don't really agree with that. I mean, Voxel doesn't make something look amazing, but it does help get make things a lot slightly easier, the more tedious things easier. Let's say, you know, you want to build a wall, it's tedious as hell to build a wall, but the, it's not going to be able to make it look nice, is it? It's just going to be able to get you the wall, it's going to get you the base model. That's why I like the, the um, plugins, because it's... It's just quicker. It's easier to do the more tedious things, but, but there you go. So, at the moment, you're just seeing me building a lighthouse. I've attached a little house to the lighthouse, because obviously, because some people think of a lighthouse as a, a tower with a beacon of light at the top, because all we all know what lighthouses do, right? To stop people crashing into rocks. Back in the days! Back in the days! Something like that, but... <clears throat> Excuse me there. I'm building this... I can't remember what kind of roof type it is, but... I was just mucking around here, seeing what different roof types I can add. I just ended up going in this specific direction, so I was just thinking that if I did it in the opposite direction, it would, like, most likely have collided with the tower, and I didn't want that to happen. I visualized it in my head and could see it happening, and, yeah, that's just the way I went with it. With the tower here, I'm just trying to make it, I'm trying to make it as bigger than the house, because obviously it wouldn't be a very good tower otherwise, and I'm trying to make it collide in a way that it looks like it's meant to be there, looks like if you were to live in there, it's it's stable. And that's the way I, I tended it to be. Now, you can see here a bit of skipping. Jim joined the server. It was we, He was just wondering what the hell I was doing because I, I didn't really tell him what I was doing. But Well, I did, but like originally this was a... like He had the idea of building like a medieval zombie town. Uh, I'm not sure what he meant by that. Otherwise, we were thinking... It was either literally a town of zombies, as if they were, like, living, as if they had their own colony, if it was to be said like that. Or it was a plague that was rid of a town. This was originally an outpost of some kind, but it ended up being a lighthouse, and, you know, I, I kind of stuck with that. <laughs> it's, it's funny how you can just randomly build things, and it ends up being something else. It's rather neat, but... It's neat work here, but I used a, a mix of different log types here. I used the, it's, I'm not sure what wood type that is, I think it's um, log type 4, but it's it's got like a slimy, rustic look to it, so it looks kind of old, it looks like it's been worn down, it makes it look like it's been there for a while, but then I also used a combination of um, these wood types to give it some kind of aesthetical feel to it, make it um, contrast, I'm not sure what the wording is, but no, I'm not, a, I'm not an artiste, I'm not sure if that has anything to do with art, but... But anyway, we're building something here. We're building on Minecraft. But it's hard to actually continuously talk about something because, I mean, it really is just you building things, isn't it? You see a little skip there again. I'm kind of new to the, uh, you know, the speed thing, Jig. I'm trying to get the uh, proper configurations done right. But I be well, I'm making some uh, interior here, just, you know, making it look a bit nicer. I'm trying to make a, a spiral stair sort of thing going on here with one pole in the middle. So it's kind of a carious and walking up it was all right. Now this is when I'm working on the uh, the tower of it. It's more interesting part. Trying to look at different designs here, looking around, see what's up. And I'm going to make a little rooftop here. I'm not going for the the average uh, lighthousey look sort of style or you know tower look where it's like completely covered at the top. I'm trying to make it sort of medieval, sort of like they really couldn't put a roof in there. But like you can see here, I've I'm going to put like a, a half roof. It's going to, like, see, I'm finishing off the roof here, but it's not completely done up. I'm covering the bits with uh, wood logs. Uh, it would originally be glass, but I just thought they'd look much better, seeing as it was a medieval tower. Now, I believe I look around the tower and feel it just doesn't have enough. It just You look at it, it just looks really dull, looks kind of boring. 
So I thought I'd add a few windows in here, and I tried a few different fills to the windows as I, not windows as um, actually I'll just call them windows for now. But uh, I thought by the end of it, I just thought you know I'm gonna put some uh, skirts around the um tower in different ways, and I felt that if I put it to adjusting to the bottom of each uh, window, it would have some sort of repeating effect there, and it worked out very nicely. Uh, I wanted to do like some extra add-on in the different dimension of the skirt, but I ended up not doing that otherwise because it would have collided with it and it would have looked kind of odd. Uh, I'm trying up some different attachments here. I went for them. I'm uh, making the uh, spiral staircase very easy to do, very nice though. It's a very simple spiral staircase. There we are. It's <laughs> gonna finish that off. I stop for a while. I stop every now and again. Uh, or if you see cuts, it's usually when uh, something has happened. Um, muck about world. Wow. That's what I called it? Anyway, yeah, but I tried the uh, muck about the skirts again. See what's up. Just looking at it, really. Seeing what I can add. I had another window here, and I use... Just trying to see different effects. Seeing if, like, maybe if I use the, um, lighter wood around the window, it can m have more contrast with the, uh, the area around it. So I kind of just put it in there. Thought that would look good, but I did decide not to go for that because I don't really like windows being at that level. But I decided to do that, and see here I'm filling in the uh, the windows with these fences. It does give a very very nice look. I like it a lot. Filling in the area here and onwards and there. I actually do go for the uh, the surrounding of the uh, windows. I thought it looked a nice effect. Although I didn't do it to the tower because it collided with the um, with another idea that I have coming up. I didn't like that, so I decided to get rid of it. I, I it's, It depends, because when you look at a building, you want to see what looks good inside and outside. And it's very difficult to do something like that, because you want something to be visi visibly awesome to look at, but not only that, you want it to be useful in the inside. You want it to also look nice in the inside, but, you know, have a purpose, if that is. I actually believe I do the light at the end, because originally I didn't want it to be a lighthouse. See, right here, I just get the lighthouse bit done. I decide to use cobblestone, because, I mean, I use fire. <laughs> yeah, brilliant, let's use wood for fire. But I decide to use cobblestone, because it gives a nice effect. Looks like it's kind of scorched in some ways. I'm using the, um, I'm using a text pack I can't remember the name of. I sh may put it in the description if I still remember to. <laughs> wow, irresponsible, there you go. But I look for the flint there, put the fire in, very nice effect. And there you have it. There's my little lighthouse here. Um, <laughs> don't know. It's I, I found it kind of tough to talk about what I'm building because I haven't had much experience in this talking thing. The thing, <laughs> thing. Let's say thing. But hope you liked it. I certainly enjoyed it. Looking at the lighthouse spin around there. Very cool. That's the finished product, though. Hope you like it. Um, like, favorite, subscribe. Hope you give us some neat ideas. To be honest, I would like to hear your ideas. I'd like to hear your ideas and, uh, and thoughts on what we should build next. Uh, stuff like that. I, I, we, I built the lighthouse at random, but we really don't have an amazing amount of original ideas, to be honest. We could build things, but we like to hear what you guys want us to build, because it gives us a better reason to build them. Because, well, let's say you're... Uh, Maybe your building skills isn't up to it, or maybe you can't be bothered to build it yourself and just, you know, want to watch someone else build it. Then, you know, just just ask, top, put it in the comments or something like that, if you want something smaller than this. If you want something um, much more specific, let's say you can always email us at uh, gamerpeons at hotmail.co.uk. That's always something you could do. <laughs> yes. If you want to, that is. I doubt you would. You could just join in the comments, though, if you want something done. And we can't guarantee it would be done, because <laughs> we just pick something we think is cool and we can do, and then we'll build it to the best of our ability and pop it up. But I uh, hope that's good enough detail here. Hope you enjoyed this little presentation here of my building abilities. We're looking to build much more, much better looking much more amazing things, that's the word I was looking for, much more amazing things than a lighthouse, but, you know, things like a lighthouse, or, you know, an awesome looking house, or a mansion, stuff like that, you know, they're the little things, they're the things that you think, they're, they're not epic, but they're nice, 
And it's something that you should always pay attention to. But hey, this Minecraft building. Uh, but hope you enjoyed. Like, favorite, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.